In Estonia, the public sector is required to support state-issued EID for all public e-services. Estonia's EID is built on an open platform and offers a wide range of benefits which lowers business costs and saves time. On customer identification, paperless contracts, automated business flow, secure delivery of sensitive data and so forth. EID enables paperless administration, not only in the public sector, but also business environments. Many large organisations such as banks, telecommunications, energy companies and many others have incorporated state-issued EID into their e-services and intra-organisational solutions. It offers people the freedom to accomplish tasks without any time or spatial constraints. Estonia's state-issued EID platform is cost-effective and reliable, and it guarantees a person's authenticity. The e-service provider does not need to develop any additional authentication instruments and is able to utilise the state-issued product instead. The qualified electronic signature created with Estonia's EID is equal to a handwritten signature according to the EIDAS regulation. It is usable in all EU member states and recognised for cross-border transactions. To provide a qualified electronic signature with the EID, a solely controlled device with qualified certificates must be used. A timestamp and evidence of certificate validity are added to the signature, making this type of signature very difficult to falsify. The encryption and decryption feature of Estonia's EID allows one to securely transfer confidential data. This type of encryption should only be used for short-term purposes, as EID certificates expire, as do the decryption keys stored on the EID chip. Encrypted files can be sent to recipients via traditional channels such as email or file sharing platforms without the risk of compromising confidentiality and integrity. The government-backed EID software makes it easy to encrypt and decrypt sensitive data. One must know the receiver's personal identification number to encrypt data so that the receiver can use his EID with PIN1 for decryption. It is also possible to use the ID card as a customer loyalty card for businesses. The ID card represents the individual's identity, which is then associated with his or her customer data in customer relationship management systems. In practice, switching to state-issued EID would require a small adjustment. The connection between the card and the customer can be established either in the existing loyalty or access system or read directly from the EID card. In this way, the client does not need to have multiple loyalty cards and the company saves money on costs associated with developing a complicated card management system and the unnecessary printing of loyalty cards, which also helps to preserve the environment. In Estonia, many retail chains and communities have adopted state-issued EID cards as their customer loyalty cards. The trend is growing. Estonia's EID system is based on public key infrastructure and uses carefully chosen cryptographic methods based on best practices. The private key is in the sole possession of its user. The key is created and stored on the chip that is located in the EID carrier, a smart card or SIM card chip. In Estonia, state-issued EID is a reliable method of identification as the individual's identity is established in accordance with the regulation of identity documents. It means that the person's physical identification by the authorities is required when the document is issued. The technical solution includes a device that is in the individual's possession and under his or her sole control. 
To ensure system security and reliability, inclusion of a generally accepted and trusted certification authority is required. Certificates for both keys needed for authentication and electronic signing contain individuals' identification data. The certification authority has to be regularly audited and comply with international standards and requirements. Certification services provided by these authorities are also described in the trusted list of the EU and accepted by all the EU member states, particularly in the public sector. Estonia's EID end-user software and electronic signature integration software are open-source solutions providing transparency and an open platform for all interested parties. All documentation and instructions for using, implementing and developing EID are publicly available. Therefore, it is easy for companies and IT developers to integrate state-issued EID components in their products and services and possibly contribute to software development. Open source software provides opportunities for anyone to follow its logic and check whether the installed software originates from the source code. Open source software allows all interested parties, including the private sector and academia, to benefit from it without registration or other limitations. Though the solutions are open source, Regular security tests are conducted to make certain that best practices are being utilised. Therefore, the uniform and open platform ensures transparency and trust as well as compatibility. The use of Estonia's EID public key certificates is unlimited. Public sector and public e-services, where identification is required, have to acknowledge and implement state-issued EID. Although the EID system is government-backed, its use is not limited to the public sector. The public key infrastructure used in Estonia allows anyone to gain access and use the EID public keys and to check for certificates' authenticity and validity without limitations. As a general rule, services provided by Estonia's public sector are available online. The state's interoperability framework stipulates best security practices to be used by state-issued EID. According to the EIDAS, Estonia's EID is acknowledged with the highest level of assurance within the EU. This status grants access to all public sector e-services in all EU countries. Estonia's EID system is secure, reliable and transparent. It continues to develop and adapt to changes within the environment. Though Estonia's electronic identity is widely used, particular attention is paid to risk management. In essence, the types of misuse can be divided into three subgroups – technical issues, user carelessness and authenticity of identity. The state takes measures to manage technical risks, including regular cryptography research that assesses trends, providing information to re-evaluate the strength of algorithms, updates in the EID software to keep it up to date with the newest developments, mitigate risks and eliminate potential attack vectors. Engagement in open risk management. Open discussion regarding risks and threats with the community. Cooperation with research institutions and the private sector. Maintenance of EID system transparency by allowing users to see their EID statistics, including EID usage, and giving them the opportunity to discover any possible misuse. Risks associated with user carelessness rely on a person's individual management. State-issued EID identity or credentials theft is impossible without access to both the individual's PIN codes and an EID carrier, which makes this type of fraudulent activity practically non-existent. Also, 
people are being continuously educated about any potential problems arising from negligence. In Estonia, EID is government-backed, meaning the state authorities establish the person's identity based on information from authoritative sources before handing over the ID card and the pins for using EID. All of this makes Estonia's EID system widely used and trusted. Estonia's EID system is a reliable, secure system and based on best practices. It is usable for all state e-services and available for extensive use in the private sector. It provides means for electronic authentication, timestamp signing, encryption and decryption. It can also function as an effective substitute for a customer loyalty card. While based on openness, a high level of risk management is involved to maintain system security.